Welcome. We illustrate here briefly a few dynamical systems featuring chaos, which relate to unsolved problems in the field. Chaos remains an enigmatic subject in mathematics. I myself have started my research in this fascinating area. The choice of the list is, of course, personal. The standard map is a simple area preserving map on the two-dimensional torus. We measure sensitive dependence on the initial conditions for the parameter c bigger than 2, but we cannot prove it. In the next slide, we will see an example for c equal to 2.4. The Newtonian n-body problem is one of the oldest dynamical systems. Our solar system is an example. While collision singularities have been shown to have measure zero, we do not know about non-collision singularities. Already the three-body problem seen in the next animation shows complicated motion. Billiards in a convex table is called Birkhoff billiard. No example of a smooth table with positive metric entropy has been found yet. A candidate is the L4 table, x to the 4 plus y to the 4 is equal to 1. You will see in the next slide some orbits for the L3 table, x to the 3 plus y to the 3 is equal to 1, and then see how the phase space changes from the integrable circle case p equal to 2 to p equal to 4. Also, the double pendulum shows chaos, but we cannot prove it yet. <clears throat> Energy surfaces are, in this case, three manifolds. The mathematics is just not ready to prove anything rigorous about the entropy. We see next an animation. The exterior builder is an area preserving map on the outside of a convex table. In the smooth case, there are invariant curves preventing the orbits to escape to infinity. That's KM theory. Even in the differentiable C1 case, we do not know yet. Blasov dynamics generalizes n-body dynamics for smooth particle densities. It is an infinite dimensional Hamiltonian system for which we observe the system to converge to equilibrium in general. The system is usually written as an integral differential equation for the density m. We write it as an ordinary differential equation on a space of smooth functions describing the deformation of the density. One can look at cellular automata as finitist versions of partial differential equations. The time change is given by a law updating the state at the point, which depends only on a spatial neighborhood of a cell. This produces a dynamics with finite propagation speed. Most famous cellular automaton is the game of life of Conway, which is in d equal to 2. We will look uh, next at the one-dimensional d equal 1 cellular automata rule 18, probably the most famous one which shows uh, complex features. The motion of a rigid body with or without external force has been studied for a long time. Our Earth is such a spinning top. Sofia Kovalevskaya has found a new integrable case besides the rotational symmetric case. <clears throat> in general, we see chaos, especially in higher dimensions. The rigid body dynamics is largely unexplored. The animation next shows a simple toy top. The logistic system is a quadratic map on the unit interval, depending on a parameter. Mitchell Feigenbaum has observed a universality. Oscar Langford proved it computer assisted. There are still many open questions, like for example, how large the parameter values are with positive Lyapunov exponents, or whether the entropy graph is a devil staircase, meaning that there are intervals where the topological entropy grows in a strictly monotonic way. In the next slide, we see just the bifurcation diagram. Finally, we look at the dynamical system in the context of networks or topology. When iterating the barycentric refinement, we see universal features. The limiting object, however, is largely unexplored. In the two-dimensional case, that's the animation we see next, we see a network and just the first two barycentric refinements.
that's it. <coughs> Here are some notes on the production of this presentation. This is the end.